How's it going, guys? Making a little tuna helper today. And I also thought I would do a, uh, a video on the different types of tuna. We've got six different kinds here. I just opened this one. This is a natural yellowfin chunk light tuna. Back it off a little bit. Where you can see the, uh, it's pretty shredded in there. Lots of water. Do a taste. Um, it kind of looks like cat food. Uh, consistency of about like oatmeal. And a good salty taste with hardly any fishiness to it. Uh, let's see. We've got Fisher tuna. Chunk light. Now, all these, I believe, are in um, water. Now, my secret weapon. This is a uh, gives me an idea of how much moisture uh, or water that they added to the product. I also can see the color, the clarity of it. And another um, pretty shredded. Not much uh, a lot more salt in this one and um, a more pronounced fishy taste figured this would be appropriate for um, after Hurricane Barrel. MC Trader Chunk Light Tuna and Water. But as you can see, the clarity of it is really clear. It's not, uh, it's 
doesn't look like a poultice. <laughs> Can, uh... Seem to open well. Tuna. A little bit different. Um, just a little bit of salt, not much, not real salty. And I would say, uh, the least pronounced tuna flavor. And we have um, Wild Skipjack from Wild Planet. It's a pull ring top, cool little. I think we got a winner winner chicken dinner. Oh, my goodness. Gotta pour it off. <laughs> I was so surprised at the little, uh, the little cuts. As you can see, this is, uh, like big pieces. Nice and firm. Mm -mm -mm. Best one by far. Nice firmness to the uh, to the meat. Excellent taste. The perfect amount of saltiness. Or should I say brininess? <laughs> Sorry, I can't have that. And the least amount of fluid in it, or liquid. I won't suffer the tuna smell. In case you're wondering, um, I washed the lids and the tins after I dumped the liquid out for a meow kitty in her perfect little serving bowl, and um, none of the fluids will go to waste. We got uh, Chunk Light Tuna in Water Premium Wild Caught by Great Value. Really impressed with that skipjack tuna. That was like, man, I could throw just a little seasoning off of that. And eat it, eat it straight out of the can. 
Okay. The least fluid of all of them. Uh, beautiful cuts. Uh, you can see texture in this one. It's not been floating around in, uh, in the brine. Let me get that little like artichoke part out of there. <laughs> Good texture, but a tinny taste. Real, um, real metallic taste. And I, I, I don't know if I said the lowest um, moisture content, added moisture of them all and then the Orleans chunk light tuna and water now canned tuna course is going to have uh, a kind of a canned tuna taste okay presentation pretty good uh, this and the uh, great value are going to tie for the least amount of moisture added moisture content still pretty soupy um, mm. great taste to this this Orleans um, really good taste real clean salt content uh, is just about perfect a little more mushy than the other ones but uh, really good now in um, In order of me liking them, taste-wise, all around, this was the best. This is a Wild Planet Skipjack Tuna. Best flavor. Uh, water, moisture content. Uh, these, these two... Um, you know for bang for your buck um, and most metallic tasting is this great value if you off putting by that well guys I sure hope you enjoyed the uh, the tuna tasting uh, and I hope if you was affected by the storms that uh, you're not sweating sweating to death and um, everyone is safe peace out from Texas